Welcome back. Um, let's pray. Thank, thank you, Heavenly Father, for this time that we get to spend in your word. I hope uh, that it will be fruitful. I hope that we can understand your word. Lord Jesus, speak uh, through your word so that we can understand, so we can apply it for our, our day today. In Jesus' name, amen. Okay, um, Psalm 9 is different. Um, it says, I will praise thee, O Lord. I can't see it. It's dark outside. I will praise thee, O Lord, with my whole heart. Just like Psalm 119. How can a young man keep his way pure? By guarding it according to your word. And I have sought you with all my heart. I think that's one. Uh, so basically that's two ways. You could guard it with the word. And seek seek after him with all of your heart. And that's what it says here. Um, and I'm going to show forth. Um, I will uh, show forth all your marvelous works. How awesome is that? I will be glad and rejoice in you. I will sing praises to your name. I'm paraphrasing a little bit. It's thy and thou and thine. But don't get caught up with that. I don't want to. So, um, it's singular. It's only for that person who chooses to believe and that person who chooses to worship God with their whole heart. So it's not for everybody. It's everybody is invited to do that, but not everybody will. All right. Let's see. When... Oh boy, it's getting too dark for me. I can't see it. Okay, fine. I'm going to cut it short. So, uh, today I was having a casual uh, discussion um, with my wife. And I told her that, uh, that she is beautiful. And then she told me, Is that all you see? What if I'm not beautiful? Then... I said like this, well, if you're not beautiful, then it's my fault. I have something wrong with my heart. I didn't even know I was going to say that. So, I am not a great philosopher, but um, I know that I love my wife. And I, uh, I love Jesus too, and I hope that... Uh, that you also love him and worship him.